Shalom. Back again. At the campground site this morning. Another one. <clears throat> Up early. You know, when we go camping, you can't help but wake up. You can't help but just get up early. So, as the sun arises, you arise. But anyway, we're here. I don't even know what park this is. We're going to hit it again today. We're hoping that God guides our hands, our footsteps, towards something he has for us pretty soon. All the way, we're going to keep going until we get it. Something to think about is different criteria that you want to look at for property. Things like usable land, flat areas, things you can build on. Uh, you have hilltops, mountain tops, mountain sides, hill sides, um, slopes, and I mean, it's a lot of things we really didn't take into account because when you see things from an aerial view, uh, when you're searching for land, you have an idea of what it's going to look like, how you can do it until you actually get there. And when you get there, you see it's not what you once thought. Like a property going down to a valley or uh, some type of crevice where, you know, both sides are coming in, you know, you're just down in the valley. Uh, or you walk upon a land that's all mountainside. Or you might be looking at 30 acres, but only seven of the acres are actually usable or livable on. You know, except for animals, I suppose. It depends on how steep or uh, that mountainside or hillside is, uh, that angle of it can be. So these are some things that, you know, we should have took into consideration or that we are now taking into consideration. We didn't do that early on. So that's pretty much the sentiments right now. But we're almost done packing up. We're about to get it done. And we're gonna move on to the next next phase in this thing. So we're gonna come back on, show you guys some more videos. We it's gonna take a while for us to get the drone footage up because we need a lot of internet and time to be able to upload something like that. So just stay tuned, we'll put it together. I'll put it on here. Even if we don't buy land, probably gonna put it on. It's a lot of footage. Uh, it's pretty cool footage actually and if you plan on getting some property or some land and really just to have in general I think it's a good idea I mean, we really had the idea from brother Randy um, but we thought it would be a good tool for us to, to use if we really didn't feel like walking the entire property but as of, as of, uh, but so far every property that we ran up on we, we've, we've been interested and we've walked the entire property so uh, we found a pretty good property. I mean, we've been all over Kentucky, been Alabama, been Tennessee, uh, a piece of Georgia. I mean, we, we've we been driving all over, putting a lot of miles on this truck. But, you know, that's what we got to do if we're going to be set apart, live set apart. It's a lot of work that ain't easy. Um, it would be nice if you could find a property, go look at it, I like it, and you buy it. But that's just not the case. So... It is what it is. We're going to keep going, keep chugging it on the way. You're really going to get out there and know what's out there is if you actually put one foot in front of the other and get after it and actually have some action that goes along with your faith. And that's exactly what we're doing. So we're about to get up on out of here. The brothers are pretty sure almost done taking this tent down, and we're going to roll. we got to go. we got quite a few properties to hit up today, probably about five at least. Five at least, I'm thinking we we, uh, we want to hit up. We want to make sure that we get uh, boots on the ground on. So we're going to go ahead and get after y'all. Shalom.